are gathered here to formally recognize those students who have been selected by the faculty of our school for successfully completing their candidacy and are being inducted as new members of our NHS chapter. For current members and those former members who may be among our guests, we hope this will serve to remind you of the standards of excellence you too are charged with maintaining as members of the nation's oldest, largest, and most prestigious student recognition program. Our chapter is proud to be inducting these new members with tonight's ceremony, indicating the continuing emphasis on excellence that we represent for our school and community. Throughout the years, members of our chapter serve as role models for other students. In addition to the strong academic records which establish our eligibility for membership, our chapter members are leaders in many student organizations, and we serve our school and community through many activities. We are proud of this record of accomplishment and welcome these new members who may bring energy in support of our continuous work as NHS members. First, we will have greetings from our NHS sponsor, Ms. Michelle Mangino. Being on this stage means that you have distinguished yourself as a student with great potential. 
Not every student gives hours a day to play a sport, an instrument, or form of art. Not every student gives up their weekends to volunteer where help is needed or trying to refine their own interests outside of the classroom. We strive today to better ourselves in character, leadership, service, and scholarship. Tonight, you become role models and leaders for other students looking up to you for guidance and help. Within the National Honor Society, you will do great things. Last year, the National Honor Society provided service at local community events, participated in school activities, and volunteered at local elementary schools to mentor, provide leadership, and be role models to younger and future students at Thorne High School. As a member, you will complete at least 12 hours of community service between now and June. However, it's the small things that you do every day that will define the National Honor Society when the class of 2019 leaves. Those are the things that will define you as individuals. I hope and trust that you will live up to these expectations. I pass the torch this evening to the new generation of members of the National Honor Society. All of you are leaders. Whether you are leaders because of your academics, sports, or clubs, you represent the part of the school community we are most proud of. I trust that each and every one of you will strive to live up to the expectations of your community, school, and most importantly, yourselves. Thank you. Next we will have another inspirational reading by one, another one of our members, Simone Winter, is reading Unique by Amabula T. Alapu.
Character. Character is the force within each individual that distinguishes that person from others. It gives each one individuality and personality. It is what it is that without which no one can respect oneself, nor hope to attain to respect of others. It is this force of character that guides one through life, and once developed, grows steadily. Character is achieved and not received. It is the product of the constant action, daily striving to make the right choice. The problem of character is the problem of self-control. We must be in reality that we wish to appear to others. By demonstrating such qualities as reality, honesty, and sincerity, we may hope to prove by example that we value character.
Guardians. Um, first of all, let me just celebrate something here. Just this is very selfish. I'm gonna hit it right. Congratulations, bros! All the guys up there. We got some guys up there. I see that in a moral decline. 
right? So I'm glad that you all have, you know, you, you're in the National Honor Society, you're amongst honor students, of course, uh, parents and guardians, we have many more honor students than these. However, this elite group, are, they're, they're, they're comprised of meeting and exceeding certain particular standards to meet this group. So they're what I call the few the proud, right? That's who they are. But no one, no one even understands these students and everybody here. You all represent the moral authority of a, of, of, a, of a world that's fallen. So you represent a new generation that's ushering in the moral authority that's needed for our, our civilized society to carry on to that next stage, to that next level. So please don't take this work lightly. Don't take that title lightly. Uh, carry it, carry it well. Be great ambassadors for Thornton Township High School. Be great ambassadors for yourself and be great ambassadors for your proud parents. Thank you, everybody. in the garden room, we'd love for you to join us and continue the celebration. At this time, if you want to come take pictures, please come to the front. You may do that as much as you need. Thank you.